Stephen Twitch Boss's mom is sharing her heartbreaking wish after her son's tragic death. On Tuesday, Connie Boss Alexander shared a screenshot of her FaceTiming the late dancer on her Instagram story, writing, Oh, if only I could FaceTime to heaven. In the photo, the Ellen DeGeneres show DJ wears a black tux, bow tie, and chain as he talks to his mother. Connie's heartbreaking post comes days after she first addressed Twitch's death on social media, writing, quote, Family and friends, thank you for all the love, prayers, and encouragement. Please know I see all the messages, texts, posts, and the phone calls. I can't use words right now. Please know I will reach out when I can. Please continue to keep us in prayer. Stephen Laurel, your mother loves you to eternity and beyond. The TV personality was found dead on December 13th. The Los Angeles County Medical Examiner Coroner ruled his death as a suicide one day later, Access Hollywood confirmed. On December 14th, his wife Allison Holker shared a statement regarding her husband's death, writing, quote, It is with the heaviest of hearts that I have to share my husband Stephen has left us. Stephen lit up every room he stepped into. He valued family, friends, and community above all else, and leading with love and light was everything to him. He was the backbone of our family the best husband and father, and an inspiration to his fans. To say he left a legacy would be an understatement, and his positive impact will continue to be felt. I am certain there won't be a day that goes by that we won't honor his memory. We ask for privacy during this difficult time for myself and especially for our three children. Twitch and Allison got married in 2013 and celebrated their nine-year wedding anniversary two weeks ago. They have three kids, 14-year-old Wesley, 6-year-old Maddox, and 3-year-old Zaya. Back in March 2021, Allison talked to Access Hollywood Scott Evans about her relationship with Twitch. Who is the good cop, bad cop in those situations between you and Twitch? Okay, I have the sweetest husband that anybody <laughs> could ever ask for because, bless his heart, I come up with the craziest ideas and I'll be like, babe, we're painting the room right now. And he'll be like, oh my gosh, like, what do you mean? I'm like, you got to figure it out. We're doing it now. Like, it's not really like an ask of like, hey, how do you feel about this? It's more like, it's happening. let's do it now. Right, it's happening. Yeah, it's happening. And you're, just, you're on board, right? Like, how are you not going to be on board? Like, I'm so good. Like, we got this. Don't you feel like you learn a lot about your relationship in those home projects? Oh, yes. Oh, yes. <laughs> and my husband will tell you, he loves me. He loves me. He breathes me. But I am definitely like, we got to do this. Boom, boom, boom. I'm like moving all fast and he's all slow. Like, he would like like to watch the paint wall dry <laughs> when I'm like on to the next project. Exactly. We've been checking in with you guys all kind of uh, pandemic, really, since the beginning of this thing. But how are you guys doing now? Is the family good? Is everybody feeling great? Everyone's doing really good, honestly. Like, we get so much time together right now. We're enjoying quality time, dancing, having dance parties, doing obstacle courses, and just hanging out, cooking good food. So like everyone else at home right now, we're just trying to make the best of it.